Gamma control has been added to image content. Gamma can be used to change the contrast of a loaded image. This is great for adjusting the character of lights as seen in reflections. In the Light Properties panel, content sections have now been tabbed to reduce the need to scroll up and down a long list of properties. Content presets let you switch the appearance of a light that is already positioned in HDR Light Studio. The content presets can now be applied in the following new ways. Drag and drop the content preset onto any of the new content tabs, Master, Value Blend, Alpha Multiply. This is way faster than the previous process that required a lot of scrolling. Right click on the content preset thumbnail and choose apply to current light to apply the preset to the master content of the selected light. This method is great for scrolling around the presets and quickly and easily trying out different looks on a specific light. Drag and drop content presets onto lights in the light list to apply them to the master content. The advantage of this method is you don't need to select the light in order to apply a different lighting look. You can easily replace the appearance of many lights in your lighting design without selecting the lights first. This is a fast method for totally changing the look of the whole lighting design, changing the appearance of many lights with a drag and drop. Batch import images as presets. Drag and drop the images from your file system onto the presets panel in HDR Light Studio. This is a great way to import a batch of purchased HDRI maps and add them to your HDR Light Studio preset library to use on future lighting projects. In the batch import process, each preset will inherit the name of the original file as its description and the batch of images can also be tagged. The images are then batch converted into the .tx format and added to the user presets where they can be dragged and dropped into the image slot of any light.